Okay, in this tutorial, we're going to be looking at a different way of um, recording ADR, um, just a different way to help the actors um, to get their voices in time with the video. So, um, if you haven't already had a look at the other screencasts um, on loop recording, uh, please do so first. But if you find that loop recording doesn't really work for the actor and they're still struggling to keep in time, then there is a way of um, giving them a count in so that the timing of the first line is, is easier for them. And we're, what we're going to use for that is some beeps. So three beeps and... I've prepared some um, WAV files for you to download with the beeps on. So if you go to um, Safari and log into ShoeSpace or Blackboard, uh, you should be able to see the Creative Media Center site. So we'll load that up. And within there, you want to go to Sound, Pro Tools, and here we have sync beeps for ADR. So if you right click and download linked file, that then saves to your downloads. So go back to Pro Tools and import that file. So import audio, you can find it in downloads and we're going to copy it because copying will move it to our Pro Tools audio files folder rather than just linking to the existing file so that's good file management to add sorry to copy rather than add so when we're done with that it's going to ask where you want to save it that's in the audio files folder so that's great and we're going to put it on a new track so let's put it down here. I'm just going to move that track up a bit. And if we play that back, oh, can't hear that for some reason. Let's check the output. Okay, let's set its output. So play that back now. So that's three beeps, each one second apart. And if we look on the grid here our grid is set to one second if it's if it isn't then that's what you want to choose minutes and seconds and then one second divisions uh, and that will allow you if you go into grid mode that is that will allow you to line it up on the grid now if your first line isn't on the grid then you slip and line it up that way. So if we have a look at the original video audio. Okay. So the first word is okay. And if I move this track up here, then we can see a bit better. Okay. Okay. So that's about where he says okay. Okay. There. So if we move this, the end of this region to be the start of that region, okay. then what will happen is when we play it back with the beeps, I'll see you. Three. Okay. So on the fourth silent beep, or the fourth second, that's when the actor knows when to come in. Um, it might take them a little bit of time getting used to that, but after um, two or three goes at it, that might be the way that works best for them and uh, hopefully this they will be able to keep in time and and you will get the adr recording that you need in sync so i hope that helps and uh, look out for more tutorials in the future